Where's the 25th? Turns out there's only 24 chocolates, so I guess we don't eat one on Christmas Day? Did I really bring this one home for no reason? Why is there only 24? I swear there's maybe 25. You can't miss 25 in this one. <gasps> oh my god, it's Illamasqua. This is definitely the best thing in the whole box. It's an eyeshadow palette. Look at those colours, that top right though. My god, sand had been in the night. Actually, I heard my mum putting this by my door at one. <laughs> I love that I have a stocking inside the sack and an extra present. Gonna say, these are the twiglets I said that I usually get. Orange, a shampoo or something. Maybe a mouthwash? I don't know. I think they'll be like the gold chocolates that sit around in a box. Maybe like the conditioner, some sort of food or sweets. And these were the bits. Told you, I was right about the twiglets. I was right about this. I thought that one was mouthwash, but my mum's so good. Like, things I really need. Thanks for my stocking, mum. You like it? Yeah. Useful? Yeah. So Leah and I thought this was a blue tip when we bought this for my dad. He's actually got a book out and he's gonna look for it and let me know. I think it could possibly be this coal tip. It's not that. It is 10 to 10 and I am just finishing uploading my vlog and the thumbnail is just so adorable. I got some amazing comments, Leah. She was saying that she loves my vlogs. Watching them has inspired her to go about makeup. So proud of you. Like hearing people say this is so encouraging and I feel like I'm actually doing something good with my vlogs. More people asking for just more, you know, vlogs and that they could also relate to the cold icy bitch comments that people have said before but have warmed to me now that they have got to know me. It's one minute past ten and I'm now gonna make my vlog live. Leanne's posted a video from yesterday. Yay! I did it guys. I completed Vlogmas. I didn't think I would actually get through it. If you saw the ending of my first one I kind of joked as if like yeah let's see how far I get thinking oh I'm just gonna like fail after a week but I did it! Where's mine? I've been left out here. Morning! Daddy's making me breakfast! Look how good my mum's brows look. I should include. <laughs> I need to zoom out a bit. I learned these poses from me. I need to include how you used to do your brows when they were literally just a line. And now look at them, they're like brows on fleek. <laughs> I want you guys to put in the comments below how old do you think my mum is? She's not finished her makeup yet but I think she looks actually even younger like this. You look so good mum. Thank you. This is me. Definitely the best looking baby. This is my little brother, brother Daniel. And this is my brother Jason. Wouldn't be Christmas without Harry Potter. Skin was doing so well. Wake up. The friend, real the lack of sleep, I'm getting. Let's transform this pasty ass face. And there we go, completely transformed. Now we get changed, sort out the presents, then we can open our Christmas presents. Presents, 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 presents. What is this? All of our presents I'm gonna sort out. Dad's present, Holly. Mum's winning, look at all the mums. <laughs> Darren doesn't like presents, so. And they're mine! White chocolate. Mm. Oh, chocolate! We spray catnip on it, that's the secret. <gasps> oh. <laughs> I'm gonna open it, not rub yourself on it. <gasps> Ooh, what have you got? <laughs> this is my little brother, Mark. Say hi, Mark. Hello. What's your favourite part of Christmas? Seeing the family. Ah, oh, that's cheesy. I don't like presents. Why? You have to accept something and then you have to give something back. And look at that sneaking in the background. The cheesiest grin you'll ever see. Let's do Leanne's parents first. Sorry, this is big. To Paul, Merry Christmas, love from Juliana and Dave. Thank you. I needed some facial wash, so that's amazing. Oh, these are going to last me ages. Leanne will think will probably last me a day. Chocolate. Ha ha ha, Leanne's mum knows me well. These sweets are amazing. I know my dad likes these as well, so I'll let my dad have one. It's from Lush. <laughs> Some more Lindor. Yeah, I will be happy because I won't be stealing hers. This is from you, Holly. <laughs> on the block. Thanks, Holly. Yeah, got me a card to Leanne and Paul. Love Leanne and Ollie and Dexter. Thank you, Yannin. She got me the Saranthropology. Chan Moy, you don't know how quite you are, 
Oh, that's pretty. Thank you. That's very pretty. It's copper. Oh, copper. <laughs> From Darren and Kylie. How cute is this? Kylie even handmade the little labels. Whee! Darren and Kylie got us the matching mugs. Oh, thank you. How cute are these? These are from my parents, little fake plants. This is from my little brother. We have a voucher by the looks of it. Little black envelope here. Gift card for dogfish. Although I am savings for some um, nudie jeans. Yeah, a pair of slippers. Oh, lovely, thank you. <laughs> I, bought, I, saw, I always wanted some slippers. Beautiful bowl. Yeah. I knew you'd like the rhythm. Now, the main thing. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, Lizelle. Nice. Yeah, you got loads of Lizelle. Yeah. That's the one you said smells nice. Yeah, it sounds really nice. Oh, I got goodie. Thank you. Now we're starting with the and stuff. Diesel tattoo perfume. Thank you. I had this exact one um, when we went to New York. I lost my luggage. The diary she was going on about. It's very nice as well. It'll probably make me use it because it actually looks nice. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> no way. It's a CBG book. We were looking at this in New York. Amazing. Oh, thank you, baby. Very thoughtful. We were actually flicking through this book when we were in New York in that shop. She knows me well. It's sad that I'm not with her right now because I'd like to give her a kiss on the hand. But I'm seeing her tomorrow for Boxing Day and her parents. And we're going to be having dinner there. This I already know what it is. New Doc Martens. The big present which she has told me to leave to last. From All Saints. Fuck off. What is that? No way. No way. It's an All Saints jacket that I've wanted for like probably about five years, seven, maybe even more. I've... Oh my god, this would have cost you a <laughs> No way. See, this is why I wish she was with me right now. I'd give her the biggest hug. Made me a little tearful. That's amazing. I've literally wanted that for so long. Give it back, it's mine. Thank you, baby. I wish you were here right now so I can thank you. I'm literally blown away with that. Thank you to everyone for all my gifts. So these are all my gifts together. So blown away with that All Saints jacket. Leanne has done well. So here's the jacket that Leanne got me from All Saints. Don't know if you can see it better in this light. Maybe I'll have to do uh, some sort of haul, is that what it's called? And show you it properly. This is by far my favorite gift. And I know you shouldn't have favorites, but I absolutely love it just because I've wanted it for so long. Bless Paul, so this is why I wanted to film him opening his presents, because I wanted to see his reaction to the All Saints jacket. And brought it here to his eye, and that boy does not cry. It's all my presents from Paul. Oh, you got it! Really? Is that nice? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is the one I love. Jeffrey Star Liquid Lipsticks. And these are the colours I got. And there's palette. Thank you, Paul. These are all the presents I got. I'm feeling very, very spoilt. Look how nice this palette looks. Look at the colours. My little brother was upset that we were watching Harry Potter, so he's put on Deadpool on Christmas Day. The only uh, real guy in a, a red suit that we need to be watching. Play guess the present. I can see there's twiglets. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, a shower gel. Oh, I know what they are because I got the same. Hand wash, chocolate orange, and mouthwash. wash. I need that so I can eat, aren't I? Boom! <laughs> Everything four. useful. Oh. Orange. No, I need some hand wash. That's what I really need. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How much I read your mind. <laughs> Orange. Thank you. I didn't know what that was. So it's like mum sometimes puts stuff in a box, so I, I was a bit thrown there. <laughs> 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 well, six out of seven. Come on. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> We're all right now. Don't even do that. Go. Okay. What? No, it's too prepared. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> what am I doing? Hi. See, so, yeah, slightly older, slightly wiser. Gold here. <laughs> For me? Yeah. Well, literally just invented a new fashion. A double scarf. Check it out. Give us a twirl. <laughs> Classic. And my other brother's just been round. He's got me uh, Johnny Marr's autobiography. Christmas. It's amazing. I'm so happy. One of my favourite bands. And guitar players. Mmm, how incredible does this look? Chicken. Stuffing. Yeah. Sausages. Parsnips. Sprouts. Can't wait to eat it all. Wouldn't be Christmas without a beer. Oh, that's frothing. That's frothy. I know the trick. I know I should tip a glass, but... That is massive. What size is it? Oh, seven and a half kilos. Sorry if you're vegetarian or vegan. Dad made Yorkshire puddings. I used to hate parsnips. Now I love them. Oh, so sweet potatoes and roast potatoes. Oh, very nice. Got my martini 
And look at this Christmas dinner. We have large portions in this house. Look at that. Oh, we've got crackers to do as well. I haven't seen it before, but so far, it's all right. Oh my God, you're gonna fall off your chair. Oh, yeah. What's E.T. short for? Extra treasure. Because he's only got little legs. Then why is he short? Right. Wow. It's not fun when you have to explain it. Next one. What do acrobats like to drink? I would have said swing time, that's a plan. Water. Anything in a tumbler. <laughs> Why was the onion crying? Did he load his skin? Because he acted then he cut himself. <laughs> what did one eye say to the other eye? There's something between us what smells. <laughs> <laughs> what is Andy Murray's favourite dish? I don't know, something to do with a server, I reckon. Bangers and squash. No, bangers and mash. Smash. <laughs> oh, <what? laughs> I think I've had a few sips of martini. I was defeated. I couldn't quite finish it, but I did. Did a good job. Good it did. Going for another martini. Going to get drunk. When I was wrapping presents for Paul, and I was saying about Christmas, and I was saying that I bet my brother will have enough upstairs. That is exactly what he's gone to do. Is how sociable my little brother is on Christmas Day. He's already disappeared upstairs, and my dad's watching uh, old people stuff. So I'm gonna have to recite to my own room. Sociable family. Cheers. Cheers. Oh my god, I've had so much food. I have already have said that my brother was asleep. I knew my dad would be watching telly. My mum would be on her iPad. As I predicted, all of it came true. And then I moaned to my dad. I was like, I knew this would happen. And then he's like, okay, what do you want to do? And I was like, I want to play board game. Found them that under my bed, I have Scrabble and Monopoly. So prepare for games galore. About to play Monopoly. Having to read the instructions. If we pass go, collect 200 pounds. You never even thought of it. What's that on there for? Filming. Charming. <laughs> I didn't know that. Oh, it's mine. No, get out of it. <laughs> ah, you're in prison. You're in prison. Oh, I go to prison. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Get in there. Two. Two ten. Two fifty. That's more. You, you can't count. You owe me two hundred pounds. <laughs> oh, I should have bought my property. <laughs> Mine. Go to prison. Oh. £200. <laughs> <laughs> you have no money, join the club. Oh my god, you have like, no money. Check that, that is all my dad's money. Just check that. Join my the parents club. are broke. Five, all six, of my properties, seven. all of my money. <clears throat> you lost. I'm lost. Bye bye. You're making the settlement over. I enjoyed it. E bankrupt. <laughs> oh my god, I won! That was the shortest game of Monopoly ever. I've recited to my own room and streaming 4 to the dark world. Hello, people. Right, so this is me signing off. I hope you've enjoyed my little vlogmas. Haven't really had too much to say or do, really. Leanne obviously has a more interest in life than me when I'm by myself, anyway. I'm pretty boring. My family. We weren't really together very long. One of my brothers lives in Spain, so he couldn't be here. But it's nice to be with family, and it's nice to be surrounded by the people you love, so. It is half ten. Thought I would start to end the vlog so I can get on with editing it. I don't want to start editing really late. That's the one thing I'm looking forward to with Vlogmas ending. Not being up late editing. I'm guessing Paul's going to be excited to have me back because every evening I've been editing. So he's trying to encourage me to keep up the vlogging, whether I do like weekly ones or, you know, two a month. But I'll definitely be vlogging a trip in January. I'll film daily and then see whether it warrants having separate days or have it all in one. I've always said I would never do vlogmas. I couldn't commit to doing something like that. But then I decided to do it on a whim and because I wanted to do it. I didn't have to do it as such because I hadn't committed to it. I didn't tell anyone. I just start doing it and yeah I managed to keep it up and I've done it and more so I think people finish usually on the 24th and I'm still doing it on Christmas day for years to come I can look back at these and see like a month of me hopefully in the future I'll be like you know even in a better place so I can look back and reflect at how happy I am if that makes sense I found it so therapeutic doing this as I've said like when I speak to the camera I feel I'm really speaking to people because you guys are so good with the comments I can't wait to upload a video because I can't wait to read your comments I never thought I would do good with vlogmas and as i said earlier getting comments from women saying i've given them confidence to leave the house without makeup and they've never done that before and seeing me do it has given them confidence and that literally makes me so 
happy a good example to lead it's been such a journey like I never thought I would be showing myself as much as I have with no makeup on and it's really encouraged me to keep not wearing makeup if that makes sense like to be fair I only put makeup on today because I knew we were gonna have a family photo but with general public and stuff I'm really not caring my confidence has always been knocked by my skin flaring up and for some reason the past couple of months my skin's been good then you guys and your positivity has just maybe been like I don't need makeup. Like some days I want to wear it. I wear makeup because I like playing around with it. I change my hair. I change my makeup. Like I love all that. Yeah, crazy to see the journey I've been on. You know, there's days where I've cried. Um, I've been emotional and it's been really nice sharing parts of my life with you and giving more of an insight to me and Paul to see more of me, which you don't really get to see, I guess, unless you meet me. If you meet me in real life, like this is me. Hey. Even like a couple of months ago, I had been very, very down. This has kept my spirits up, guys. <laughs> I don't kind of want to end this. I hope this has been entertaining. I can't wait to see my girlfriend again tomorrow and be and be with her and eat her mum and dad's food. From what I saw, it looks amazing. I can't wait to eat all the little nibbles and her dad's sausage rolls. I had one yesterday and it was amazing. So yeah, looking forward to that. But thank you for watching. It's been a ride. Hope everyone has a good Christmas and a good New Year. I'm sure I'll be in the background of many more Leanne Lynn Walker videos to come. Peace. I can't wait to see Paul's footage. He sent me a video, Snapchat video, of him opening the All Saints jacket and he literally did look quite lost for words. Excited to see him tomorrow. Like, I really miss him. Like, we see each other every day. I feel like there's so much I want to say, but I don't really know how to put it all into words. But I'm just so thankful for everyone watching, for everyone supporting. Everyone that subscribed. Thanks guys. I'll see you again soon. Stay tuned for more vlogs to come. Happy 2017 guys. See you soon.